Ever looked at the fine print on a pot pie box? If not, you should, because what you don't know could make you very sick. Two years ago, banquet pot pies were found to be responsible for a salmonella outbreak, which sickened as many as 15,000 people. The manufacturer, ConAgra, never determined which ingredient was to blame, but instead of cooking the pot pies to a high enough temperature to kill any potential pathogens, which they said made the vegetables mushy, they passed the buck to the consumer. Now all the pot pie brands have instructions on the box for food, safety, and quality. I'm Michael Moss, and I'm reporting a story about how increasingly the biggest companies that supply Americans with processed food cannot guarantee the safety of their ingredients, and that even following their food safety instructions may not make the product safe to eat. I've invited investigations editor Christine Kay for this experiment. That's why I wanted to get you here and show you just how difficult it is to cook these things. A pot pie. Difficult to cook a pot pie. Let's try this banquet pot pie. This is actually the pie, the brand rather, that had the contamination problem. And they've put big instructions with pictures on the back that tell us right, exactly well, what to do. At least this is easier to follow. Let's go. Okay, hand it over. How many minutes? Four to six. Well, we're gonna cook this thing good. Okay. Wait. Oh, right. Got Sorry. what it said. Sorry. This one is actually says let's stand three minutes. Then we can eat, right? Nope. Then we have to do step four. The pie inside has got to get to 165 degrees in order to kill the bacteria. 165 degrees, I mean, that's pretty exact. How do I, how do I know if it's 165 degrees? We are going to use a thermometer. That thermometer, in that, in that little pie in there. Here's a thermometer. All right, I'm gonna stick it in the middle of the pie. It's almost at 130. 138, almost at 140. 140. Movement kind of slow now. It is slowing down. Well, let's try another spot because it says you actually have to test several spots. Let's see what it says over try here. Hot, try to get a hot spot. Okay, well, that's moving faster. 140, 145, 150. Yeah. It's sort of stuck at 158. <laughs> now, what do we do? Let's do this again. Okay. Right? All right. But, think but, this this, but this... maybe we should do it differently. Yeah. Okay. Maybe we should. What did we cook it for the last time? Five minutes. Five right minutes. We let it sit for three minutes. Okay. Right. So, what? This is a this is a twelve hundred watt. Twelve hundred watt. Okay. So I'm going to put it. Have 1, so but just to be good. safe, I'm going to put it in for like six and a half minutes. How okay. about that? Yep. That's good. But this is my pie. Where? What if you want a pie? Can I? Can I just add another one? You can only cook one at a time. So if you have three kids, you have to cook three pies. You can eat in shifts. Okay. Hey, Michael, there's smoke coming out of the microwave. That's a good sign. <laughs> it's a good sign, really? Yeah, cook that thing. All right, whatever you say. Four, three, two, one. And I'm gonna let it set this time. So three minutes, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, so it's been three minutes. Yep. This one actually got puffed up. It's Whoa. a little burnt. A little burnt. <laughs> well, that's because we gave it the extra. Right. Time. Looks done. All right. I'm okay, this you baby. take that one. Um, hitting, pushing, trying for 140, but not quite. All right, I'm like at 135, almost at 140. Right, yep, 140. Let me, let me try this. Should one. I keep this one here? No, I might as well move. Okay, but that was 